NASA and its partners launched the James Webb Space Telescope, the next generation of great space observatories. Now its first observations have just been released. Here to talk about these amazing full color images is expert Marie Egoof. Good morning, Marie. Thanks so much for joining us. Yeah, good morning, Lorena. Um, that's great. I'm very glad for I know it's, that day. <laughs> it's exciting to be a part of NASA and to finally see these images released, which we've we've gotten to take a peek at some of them over the last couple of days. First, tell us about the James Webb telescope and why it differs from something like a Hubble telescope. Yes, of course. Um, yeah, first, first of all, I'd like to say that uh, the James Webb Space Telescope is an extraordinary telescope, an extraordinary gift to humanity. Uh, this is the product of an international collaboration where thousands of people work for more than two decades to design, build, test, and launch and commission this, this incredible observatory. So I'm great, very grateful about that. And, and you know, this, this week is very special, you know, because we finally uh, get to see the very first science data from this telescope. And, and honestly, those, those data are just incredible. So the, the difference uh, between um, uh, Hubble and, and, and Webb is that uh, they are very complementary uh, type of telescope. Um, the uh, Hubble observe actually in the visible, uh, so it can see the same wavelengths of colors as the human eye, while Webb observes in the near and mid infrared. So those the wavelengths are invisible to the human eye, and you 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 need a special camera to see them, the kind of thermal imaging camera camera that you uh, that detects temperature and that you can use to see at night. So Webb is equipped with such camera. So that's the that's yes. main difference. So, so Webb ha is an infrared telescope, which allows us to see more of these colors. And that's what makes the images that we're looking at to the left so special, because these are the first full color images uh, that we're seeing. Can you tell us what we're, what we're looking at with some of these photos? Yes, yes, of course. So this is um, the web's first deep field, uh, an image of a galaxy cluster uh, where we can see thousands of galaxies from the early universe. Um, and so we can see those galaxies as they were about 13 billion years ago. Uh, can you imagine that? Um, that's, that's crazy. And so in some sense, those galaxies are the big sisters of our very own galaxy, the, the Milky Way. And of course, there are other images. But yeah, I was talking about this one. <laughs> You know, I, this one in particular, I know we talked about yesterday talking about the birth of stars. I was joking. It was sort of the maternity ward. It allowed, allowed us to see some of these images. But we're seeing the images, uh, obviously, in a much different time space space, if you will, because it takes so many uh, light years for, it to, for the images to, to reach us. What do you expect from Webb telescope, being that it's the most powerful uh, telescope in orbit, to maybe show us in the future? Are we going to be then seeing sort of the, the progress of some of the images that we're already seeing? Yes, yes, exactly. So we expect to learn a lot on so many uh, topics. <laughs> so how galaxies, stars, and planetary system are uh, being born and uh, how they evolve. Uh, but as um, previous great uh, observatories showed in the past, we are also getting ready for the unexpected. Um, Web is, is going to revolutionize uh, the field with extraordinary discoveries, and we do not yet what they're going to be and i can't wait to find out uh yeah that, what they're going to be <laughs> yeah I, I can't either they're certainly gorgeous if nothing else marie where can our viewers go to learn more about uh, this observatory and learn more about what web is doing Yes, um, people can definitely check out um, by themselves the first images uh, at uh, nasa.gov uh, slash web first images um, to see how beautiful they are really and to learn more about this fantastic observatory and what's coming next. Well, thank you so much for the time this morning for explaining some of uh, this with uh, Webb to us. I know you're very busy and this is an exciting time, so appreciate uh, you of course. expanding thank on you what we're me. learning. Absolutely.